Christmas is made for traditions. And at the annual Medtronic holiday program, forever pretty well sums up this one. It's my pleasure again to read a few excerpts from a letter from Ron Brown. That's Earl Bakken, who famously co-founded his medical device company in a Minneapolis garage. A few years after these startup pictures were taken, a Medtronic pacemaker was implanted in a 34-year-old heart patient and dad from Nashville, Illinois, named Ron Brown. It's your products that have sustained my life for 13 years. That 1986 letter read by Earl Bakken at Medtronic's holiday program was Ron Brown's 10th. 1998 has been a good year for me and my family. And Ron, 1999 was just warming up. The year 2001 has been a good year for me and my family. For nearly we four decades, Ron has grandchild. been writing 2005 has been and Earl Bakken has family. been faithfully no reading the annual Ron Brown Christmas August. letter. All of our four children and their families are well. I've heard 27 letters. He became part of the family. It's 38 letters. Greetings to you from Nashville, Illinois. One okay. thank you letter would um, do for some, but not Ron. I would have died. For whom um, these six Medtronic okay. pacemakers. High school graduation of a son. And a seventh uh, and still daughter, beating inside him. A son graduate from college. Each uh, represent and, events in uh, his life. Two of my sons were married. He otherwise would have missed. And then there were grandchildren. He says, I ran another 10,000 meter run. I started looking forward to that letter to hear the update. And I retired after 33 years as a biology teacher. It's like we're growing old together. Together never had more meaning. I had a close call. Than the year Ron Brown's surgeon nearly implanted a pacemaker from another company. My heart sank and I was incredulous. How, How could, could they, they ever even think, think of putting, of putting, in putting anything, anything other than a Medtronic product? Ron Brown got <laughs> his Medtronic. I didn't get to see their faces, but I knew I had a family that made a product that um, meant the world to me. Which brings us back to 2014. Aloha Kako from my home in Hawaii. With Earl Bakken now sending video greetings. So come on up there. Who would be reading Ron Brown's letter? People behind me were saying, oh, Ron Brown's gonna read his own letter. Today I have become Ron Brown, the once a year soap opera series. And then Ron read. This letter is not so much about me. About the weddings and anniversaries, 12 grandchildren, two great grandchildren, and another on the way. Without your products, I would be a, a fading photograph in a family album where I would be identified as, that was my dad, that was your grandpa. How can I say thanks? For the 38th Until time, December, Ron Brown God just did. All. Sincerely, Ron Brown. The sort of thing that can happen. Ron, can I get my picture taken with you? <laughs> when one takes the time to write. Oh my God. From the heart. You're amazing. <laughs>